Portugal to the Indy in Brazil. A weekly show by Geisa Fernandes. Episode 13 How badly do you need a day off? A talk about time management. How badly do you need a day off? Despite of any marketing-related talk, despite of any neuro-linguistic rule they told you, despite of, oh, you're doing what I love, despite of all that, just tell me, sincerely, how badly do you need a day off? You might ask, okay, but what are the parameters? Let's try to be a little bit more specific. Let's think, do you have the impression that your to-do list has, let's say, three times more things that you can handle? Another example. Uh, February has just started and then you look for your monthly schedule. Presuming you are an organized person and you have a monthly schedule, you look at it and then instead of saying, wow, great, I am someone who has a monthly schedule, you think, well, this is actually the amount of stuff that regular people have to handle with within a year, not a month. Does it sound familiar, my dear listener and friend? I'm afraid it does. Time management itself can be quite a confusing thing in a world full of contradictory information. What do I mean? Check it out. Would you like an example? Just think about how many times you saw commercials advertising all possible kinds of beauties, including the very big bodies, followed by programs, reports, documentaries talking about how dangerous obesity can be. This particular example happens to be very true in Brazil. I don't know what's the situation in your country, but this is just one tiny drop of contradictory information that we get every day, many times a day. And come on, we all know where it leads to. We all see people that we love, people surrounding us, getting pills to sleep and then pills to wake up, pills to be able to handle their jobs, pills, pills, pills. Time management is not only about what we do with our time, but also how we manage not to do anything at all. If the idea of simply relaxing terrifies you, Then, my friend, let's face it, you also need a day off badly. But it's no need to be ashamed. No, 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 no. After all, we are only human beings. And let me tell you a secret. I did take a day off last week. Yeah, to tell the truth, it was only a half a day off. But on a terribly busy week, it made all the difference. You know, when you've sent all the emails, when you've filled all forms, and you basically have to wait for the answers, and you don't have to be pushy, so you know you got to wait at least 24 hours, well, that was the time when I thought, why not? And since I didn't have a good answer at the time, I just gave up and said, day off it is, or half a day off, okay. Did it change my life? No. Did it change my overscheduled month? No. Did it change my week? Definitely, yes. With a rested mind, I could deal with the replies from those emails I've sent the day before much better. I could digest the nose better. And I could stay calm and face all the future work that the yes replies implied. That is, far from distracting you from your main goals, taking a day off actually makes you work much better on the following day. And by better, I mean 
more focused, more effective, and most important of all, much, much happier. I gave you a lot to think this time, right? Don't worry, just take a break while listening to my version of Curare, the beautiful tune of Alberto de Castro da Silva, a.k.a. Bororó, one of my favorite Brazilian composers. Curare is a tune from 1940, and the version you are about to hear has the Uruguayan musician Guzman Calçada playing the guitar. Thank you very much for following me. Till next week, and for now, um beijo! Você tem boniteza E a mãe natureza Foi quem agiu Nesse zóio de índia Curare num corpo que é bem Brasil Você é toda Bahia A flor do mucambo Da gente de cor do amor confusão numa misturação bem panzeira e zoneira que tem graça e tradição pega machuca minha dor nega neguinha tudo tudinho meu amorzinho Nessa boquinha vermelhinha e rasgadinha Que tem tempero como o quê? Conta tristeza e alegria pro seu bem Que tudo vive a dizer Que você é diferente De toda essa gente que finge querer você tem um boniteza e a mãe natureza foi quem agiu nesse zóio de índia curare num corpo que é bem Brasil. Você é toda a Bahia, a flor do mucambo da gente de cor. Do amor confusão Numa misturação Bem panzeira e zoneira Que tem graça e tradição Pega, machuca, minha dor Nega, neguinha Tudo, tudinho, meu amorzinho Nessa boquinha vermelhinha e rasgadinha Que tem tempero com o quê? Conta a tristeza e alegria pro teu bem Que tudo vive a dizer Que você é diferente De toda essa gente que finge Weekly Show by Geisa Fernandes. <laughs>